So right now we're at the Agrodome. So a very, very special person in my life. I actually mentioned that in my vlogs. I'm not doing enough on sheep. So I don't know. Here you go. Here's a sheep. And there's a bunch more. And there's some sheep wool. This is actually a sheep uh, wool press. So when they share the sheep, they put the wool in here and they press it down into the bales. Made up of this stuff here. And then pack it away, send it away. So we'll go through and we'll have a look. This is the Agrodome in Rotorua, New Zealand. They do a pretty cool, pretty mean sheep show actually. I think that's the farmer over there giving him a hand. It's gotta be. I can feel that it burns inside me. We can run away, we don't gotta stay. I can feel that it burns inside me. Take away the pain, we can go and say. Trust me, I won't let you down. So that's your sheep section, as I promised. It's not too in-depth, but I'll give you some idea. I'm now on the ferry going across to Wellington, and um, it's a three and a half. I'm doing my return, empty. Just finished the tour. We had a farewell dinner last night in Christchurch. I'm now on the ferry from Picton to Wellington, and um, then from Wellington tomorrow up to Auckland. So two days empty back, return the coach to where it belongs, and then I'll finish for the season. So welcome back to the year of the life of, and, and we're going to carry on now uh, with the rest of the year that I do. We're going to do a brief on Switzerland because I'm not working the whole year this time, or the whole five months I should say. I'm only working the four, so I'm doing five weeks I think. Um, but I am going to incorporate uh, myself going to the US, uh, catch up with a friend of mine, and do some mountain biking over there, some deep sea fishing, um, and a little playing around with him for a bit, and then uh, from there go on a bit of a vacation up to... Iceland, so we're going to have a look at Iceland. <laughs> Tired, very busy season, it's been a great season. A lot of king's work. So yeah, um, and we'll carry on with that vlog from there. But um, with this one here, I'm going to put a little bit more of a montage on there as to what some of the season's been like. And then uh, after the little sheep show that we've just had, and then uh, yeah, we'll get on with it. But uh, been an exciting season, I'm a bit tired, so I'm going to have a few days off uh, from the 10th to the 20th so um, yeah we'll take some time out and then I'll hop on my plane and head over to see my mate in the US fantastic see you soon so while we were while I was editing up in the driver's room over the tenant system came a call out that there were three whales off the port side of the ship so we went down and had a look and what you see now is you'll see um, us looking through the, the the rear of the ship down towards the um, the stern there there were open viewing windows for the passengers. There's a bar down there as well. And off that side is where the three whales are. They're, very, they're a little bit away from the boat. And we can't really identify what sort of whales they are. But it was exciting because every now and again they'd come up and there'd be a bit of a blowhole. And you'd see the mist drift up and over the ocean. So it was quite good fun actually. 
But um, like I say, we didn't see what type of whales they were. And, uh, but it was exciting because everyone came down to the back of the boat and had a look. We can see the water spouts, but we can't see, um, I haven't got zoom on this, so it's going to be pretty hard to, to see them really. But you might, there's one there, a little water spout out the second window. Obviously the bulk of the body is going to be under the water, but it's quite thrilling to know there's three whales out there. We can see the little spurts coming up, little blows that they're doing. Not all ferry crossings were as nice as that one. Um, one of them I did in the morning at 1.15 or whatever it was, the ferry was to get a coach over to the North Island. It was a fairly rough um, crossing. A lot of trucks but, on um, board today. Get those animals, the ferry at night. We've, um, I think I'm going to post... Yeah, no, I've posted a ferry crossing before during the day when we've got clients and stuff on. I'm empty. And I'm relocating a, relocating a coach up to Masterton from the South Island to the North Island. Yeah. Um sleep wasn't actually meant to be had I just um, I went I had about half an hour of sleep and then this whole place is rocking and rolling the uh, cook straight's a bit rough so we're hitting a you can just feel the ship lift and then drop into the next trough so it's um it's a rougher crossing than I'm normally used to I'm fine but I couldn't get much sleep From a different star Flying over streets and our broken hearts But they can even touch us We found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Oh, getting caught in the mist There's so many that never get out of They're feeding the fears and the doubts Oh, but we go and we run to the end And we run without shame We all forget Well, Terry's Place, 147 Hereford Street, Christchurch. Fantastic coffee, good chats. It's been an awesome season, and thank you for being up so early so I can get my coffee on the way to the coach. Cheers, bro.